Here's my recommendation for how you could take a longer recording and chunk it up into smaller parts and then be able to create a video, individual videos out of those individual parts. And also if you wanted to add an intro or something to them as individual pieces, you could do that. So what I would recommend first doing is just going to the library tab and clicking on this drop down and create new library and say, we'll just call this chunks for the purposes and but we can you could name it however your project name or however that works for you um, and now okay I have this library with chunks and then what you can do is just come down and go through your video and select by clicking and dragging um, the parts that you want to keep so you want to select the areas that you want to keep so then I could right click here and then I add timeline selection to library and it's going to ask me to for a name so I'll say just call this part one and okay so now that will get added to the library um, and then I can go on and do the same thing for a couple other parts um, add timeline selection and there's part two okay and there's even a hotkey for this so if I right click here you could do control shift a so if I do that Control shift a and boom we'll call this part three okay so we got our three parts added to our chunks library here and so now what I'll do is I'll just select this delete it and so let's say I wanted to make a video out of this first part so I'll just add that to my timeline and let's say I wanted to have a intro that I have saved and maybe I have that in a different library I'll go to my uh, default library and then um, whoops sorry let me go to my Camtasia 2021 library and I've got some intros in here and so we'll just click and drag this intro down to my timeline here and just gotta make a little space Put it down here on track one bring this over and again you could do the same thing for adding um you know an outro or other things to that so i'll play this here so we got this intro happening and then i could customize this obviously with my own title and then it goes into my video clip and then i could do the outro but once you've packaged up what you want between those those clips you were saving to produce as individual videos what I'm going to do is save my project now, save as, and we'll call this video chunk video one. And there's a reason for that. So I'm going to save the project and then I'm not going to do anything else with that. I'll just go to now new project. And so I got a blank timeline and I'll go to my library. And again, I can create, grab that same, um, intro and drag that down to my timeline and then go to my chunks library and here's part two come down drag that down again build this out however you want but again now i'm going to save this project as chunk video two save then i'm going to show you kind of a hidden feature in terms of producing your videos out you could do a batch production instead of you could just go through and produce each one of these right as you make them then export the video how you want um, individually and then they can process and produce those but you could do all your work up front with your projects and then go into file batch production and then you can go and select the files so one thing to keep in mind down here is to help make it easier to find. I'm gonna narrow this down to just looking for project files. And you can see I've got my chunk video one, chunk video two, so I'm going to select both of those, click open, and oops, those are folders. So I'm gonna select the first one, add that to it, then add project files again, go back to Camtasia, I guess I gotta reset that again, and then my chunk video two, select that project open and now you can see you just select all your different ones that you'd created and then hit next and then here's where you can select how you want to produce them and you could have made if you have a specific type of way you produce and you can create a preset for that so you can easily select it but i'll do them as 1080p 
MP4s with the smart player and hit next and it'll ask me for a folder and where I want to save those and hit and you get this display showing it's producing your video files out um, and it's doing them as uh, as a patch, you can walk away, get some coffee, whatever, and come back and, and check them out when they're done.